my friends, I have earnestly desired to eat this Passover with you before I suffer. For I tell you, I will not eat it again until it is fulfilled in the kingdom of God. This is my body, which is broken for you. This cup that is poured out for you is the new covenant in my blood. Do this in remembrance of me. But one of you, here at the table, is going to betray me. It isn't me. I would never do such a thing. Of course it's not you. You're so much greater than the rest of us, aren't you? What if I am the greatest? Look. You do not realize now what I am doing. But later, you will understand. No, Lord. You can't wash my feet. This is servant's work. You are the master. Unless I wash your feet, you have no part in me. Judas. What you are about to do, do quickly. Do you understand what I've done for you? You call me teacher and Lord, and rightly so, for that is what I am. But now that I, your Lord and teacher, have washed your feet, you also should wash one another's feet. I will be with you only a little longer. Lord, where are you going? You can't come where I'm going, but you will follow later. But why can't I follow you now? I will lay down my life for you. Will you really lay down your life for me? Before the rooster crows this morning, you will have denied me three times. But I have prayed for you. My children, I'm giving you a new commandment. Love one another in the same way I have loved you. Then everyone will know that you are my disciples. Come, let us all go to the garden. Stay here, and pray that you may not give in to temptation. The spirit is willing, but the body is weak. Father, if it is possible, take this suffering away from me. Abba, let not my will, but your will be done.
Simon. Lord, why are you sleeping? It's time. My betrayer is here. Judas, is that how you betray me? With a kiss? Who is it that you want? Jesus of Nazareth. I am he. <laughs> no! Enough! Simon, put your sword away. Shall I not accept the suffering the Father has given me? Those who live by the sword will die by the sword. Am I leading a rebellion that you have come against me so heavily armed? Every day, I taught you in the temple courts, and you never arrested me. Who is it that you want? Jesus of Nazareth. I already told you that I am he. You are looking for me, then let these men go. Bind him. Wait here. I'll come back to let you in. You aren't one of this man's disciples, too, are you? No, I'm not. The members of the council have been summoned. You've proven to be quite the troublemaker. A rebel. Tell me, what do you teach that draws such attention? And your disciples? They break the Sabbath. Is it not so? I have spoken openly to the world. I always taught in the synagogues or at the temple, where all the Jews come together. So why do you question me? Ask those who have heard me. Surely, they know what I have said. How dare you talk to the High Priest like that? If I said something wrong, tell us what it was. But if I spoke the truth, why did you hit me? The Council convenes at dawn. Who are you trying to fool, Galilean? I know you are one of that man's disciples. <laughs> no. I have nothing to do with him. Teacher, prophesy. Who was it that hit you? <laughs> <laughs> it was you! I saw you in the garden! I swear, I don't even know the man.
Simon, before the rooster crows this morning, you will have denied me three times. But I have prayed for you. Who is it that you say you are? The Messiah. The Christ. Speak to me. If I tell you, you will not believe me. But from now on, the Son of Man shall be seated at the right hand of the power of God. You are saying that you are the Son of God. I am. Blasphemy! Blasphemy! What further testimony do we need? We have heard it ourselves from his own lips. Take him to Pilate. What do you want? We paid you what was agreed. Take it. Take it back. I betrayed innocent blood. What is that to us? Yes? Sir, there's a disturbance in the courtyard. Caiaphas has brought a criminal to be judged. Who is he? What charges do you have against this man? We would not have brought him to you if he had not committed a crime. Don't waste my time, Jew. What has he done? This man is misleading our nation with dangerous teachings. He started in Galilee and has come all the way here, spreading trouble wherever he goes. So he's a zealot? No. Something much worse. He claims that he is the Messiah, the King of all Jews. This is a serious problem. We have no king but Caesar. Take him yourselves and judge him according to your own law. We cannot. You cannot? We do not have the power to execute anyone. Execute him. All right, bring him inside. You claim to be the Messiah, hmm? Well, are you the king of the Jews? My kingdom is not of this world. If it were, my disciples would have fought to keep me from being arrested. So you are a king then? Yes, but my kingdom is different. I came into the world to testify the truth. Anyone on the side of truth listens to me. What is truth? I have thoroughly examined him and find no basis for your charges. No! Kill him! Look, he has done nothing deserving death. Therefore, I will have him flogged and then release him. Make sure it's severe. 39 lashes. <laughs> Begin. Not my will, but yours be done.
Look who it is! The King of the Jews! Some king you are. He's not a king until he has a crown. <laughs> <laughs> All hail the King of the Jews, your Royal Highness. Your Majesty. <laughs> All right, enough. Take him back to Pilate. Here is your king. Kill him. Kill him. Tell me, what wrong has he done? We have a law, and that law says he must die because he claimed to be the son of God. Where do you come from? You won't speak to me. Don't you realize I have power either to set you free or to crucify you? You would have no power over me if it were not given to you from God. It is my custom to release to you one prisoner at the time of Passover. Do you want me to release the notorious murderer Barabbas? Or shall I give you back your king? He's not our king! We want Barabbas! We want Barabbas! We want Barabbas! Barabbas! But what shall I do with this man? Crucify him! Crucify him! Crucify him! Fine. I will grant you your request and have him crucified. But I am innocent of this man's blood. This is your doing. You there, carry this man's cross. Hey you, get out of here, you've done your job.
Father, forgive them. They know not what they are doing. Lift him up. Pull the ropes more. Steady now. You saved others, yet you can't even save yourself. If you are God's Messiah, come down from the cross. Some Messiah you are. Save yourself. And us. Don't you fear, God. We deserve this punishment. But he doesn't. He's done nothing wrong. Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. I am telling you the truth. Today, you will be with me in paradise. My God, my God, why have you forsaken me? I thirst. This one is already dead. Make sure of it.
man was the son of God. The stone is rolled away. Do not be afraid. Why are you looking for Jesus here? He is not dead. He's alive. He's risen to life just like he told you he would. Yes, I am alive. Go and tell the disciples. They will see me in Galilee. Friends! Haven't you caught anything? Not a thing. We've been fishing all night. Cast your nets on the other side. Then you'll catch something. You too, Simon. Simon, do you love me more than these others do? Yes, Lord. You know that I love you. Then I want you to take care of my sheep. Simon, do you love me? Yes, you know that I love you. Take care of my sheep. Simon, do you love me? Lord, you know everything. You know that I love you. Then take care of my sheep. Follow me. All authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, 
and teaching them to obey everything that I have commanded you.